Bangkok-based Buddhist monk Maha Abhishat is unafraid of speaking his mind. The 30-year-old gained notoriety last October after he urged Thai Buddhists on social media to burn down a mosque for every monk killed in the country's Malay Muslim-dominated South. An insurgency that's raged for more than 12 years there has killed almost 20 Buddhist monks and injured many more. ที่โพสต์อย่างนั้นเพราะมันเป็นใช้จิตวิทยาในการปรามว่าคุณอย่าฆ่าเราอีกนะเราทนไม่ไหวแล้วนะหากคุณฆ่าชาวพุทธอีกฆ่าพระอีกเมื่อไหร่เราจะตอบโต้แล้วนะแล้วการตอบโต้ของเราคือเราไม่ตอบโต้ภาคใต้นะแต่เราจะไปตอบโต้กับญาติพี่น้องคุณที่อยู่ในภาคอื่น Although no mosque has been set alight, anti-Islamic sentiment has gained traction online. And it's via social media that Abhishad has spread his message of hostility. He's used local conflicts to further foment religious tensions, such as the Muslims' community's rejection to the building of a Buddhist park in Patani in January, and more recently, Buddhist monks' opposition to the setting up of a halal food industry in Chiang Mai. Abhishad's methods are perhaps unsurprising. He cited Myanmar's five-brand monk Ashin Viratu and his anti-Muslim teachings as a model for safeguarding Buddhism in Thailand. Some experts say the different political context of Thailand and Myanmar prevent this form of fear-mongering from causing any sectarian conflict so far. The reason being that in Myanmar, part of the former ruling Union Solidarity and Development Party appear to have supported Viratu, whereas Abhishad has no obvious backing from the Thai government. But they warn that the inaction of Thai authorities to address the issue could lead to more problems in the future. วิธีคิดแบบอภิชาติวิธีคิดอย่างนี้มันหมายถึงองค์กรสงระดับหนึ่งองค์กรพุทธบางกลุ่มที่ตกอยู่ภายใต้กรอบวิธีคิดอันเนี้ยอันนี้อันตรายอภิชาติอาจจะหยุดอาจจะเลิกไปจากเวทีนี้แต่ก็จะมีคนใหม่ที่จะเป็นใครก็ไม่รู้ขึ้นมาอีก Buddhists and Muslims in Thailand have lived together peacefully for many centuries. And experts say that the current growing anti-Islamic sentiment only represents a small minority within the Thai Buddhist community. In response, religious leaders here are promoting interfaith dialogue and a greater cultural understanding between different religions. More than 93% of Thailand's population are Buddhists, compared to about 6% who are Muslim. Panu Wong Shaung, Channel News Asia, Bangkok.